Hey everyone, welcome back to the Bloodborne walkthrough lore through series. Um, we are here in the dream. Uh, I'm. A, what is it? Very. Let me. And we're going to grade our endurance. And I'm going to go back to Cathedral Ward and continue on. We're going to go to this side area right now, which uh, I think we should definitely go right now uh, to this area. We're going to go to Hemwick, so we can gain the ability to use the runes that we uh, just collected. We're actually going to gain, I think, one or two more in the process, so hopefully I don't screw this up. like to get to Hemwick and then beat the boss in Hemwick in this uh, episode. It's a lot, but I think we can do it. Saw spear OP. Okay. You cheated, sir. go up here now. Cold blood. We will wait till they pass. way. This little looks hidden, but it's not hidden area. And there is another side to that, so we got the bloodshot eyeball. This is another chalice material. Material used in a holy chalice ritual, an exquisite eyeball removed quickly after death, or perhaps even before. Used to unlock a seal of an old labyrinth ender tomb. Old Hunter's Mark here. And we can see we're entering. Ah. Come on. Hemwick. It's really cool. We just go this way. And. This is a cluster of an area. These guys can drop twin blood shards as well. There's another gunman over there. And a dog.
slick. That's what I wanted to do. Man, look at all this. Are those guys. That. Not what I wanted to do. those witches later. Pretty safe if we die we can come back. Wanna go around here. Slowly. Why can't I lock on to you? As you can see, this is a really cluster F of an area. That was real close. That was really dodgy. But we get bone marrow ash, which is huge in this next area for a particular section. Thick cold blood. Let's read what the bone marrow ash is. Additional medium that strengthens quicksilver bullets, according to their workshop, the special bone marrow ash collected from Henwick Channel, available to hunters with weak blood tinge require use of stronger firearms. So, they're bullets. You enhance your bullets with them. And, uh, they're gonna be really awesome in the next area. Got everything. Oh, we didn't. 
We've got more, more bone there. Awesome. Uh, now, let's go back real quick to the hunter's dream and level up a bit. Definitely need to level up vitality. Now I'm going to work on getting a vitality up to 30. And then, um, stamina. Very well. Oh, See, it's actually the second headstone. We are 11 minutes in. Actually, 12 minutes in. We can do this. We gotta go get these old ladies. around here. It's gonna be right here. Twin Bloodstone Shards can actually upgrade. Our uh, cleaver. Bloodshot Eyeball. I think we already read that again, but it's another. Uh oh. You came from down there? You evil witch. You son of a witch. Come up here. I have an NPC here. Did you hear the graveyard murmurs? Then it's almost time. Oh, I can't wait. I just can't wait. <laughs> Graveyard murmurs? Did you hear the great any? <laughs> now this right here is gonna be a short but then we'll I actually love this area of the game. Um, not super long, it's kind of a little bit, it's a little short. Up this way. Molotov cocktails. The dog patrolling there. Get him. We'll drop some twin shards. I was getting lucky in my uh, Twitch playthrough, twitch.tv slash bigbadtimber, if you want to follow. 
with uh, some of the community helped me out remembering how to play this game. I'm getting lucky with the drops. Um, I planted them this game two years ago, I want to say. So we're gonna have to actually move it a little right. That gate's gonna unlock. We're gonna have to unlock that. Wanna move, obviously, because she's throwing. Put on. Two more twin bloodstone. Really nice. That's going to be the ultimate short there. Come up here. Wait and they ambush us. Not today. side over there. Don't be fooled. I sworn there was something else. an ambush waiting. Now this is the shortcut up here. The elevator from the beginning. Enter this. Oh, this is good, but it does bypass a lot. Now we'll get our bone marrow ash ready for this area. He's trying to push us off. More bone marrow ash. supposed to actually do is I was supposed to lure him down and kill him with bone marrow ash but I figured I could get the drop on him and I completely forgot geez here so are you
adept once uh get blood gemstone and we get more madmen which is really that's right there get insight more bloodshot eyeballs we get. I'll need to go hey go do those uh channels dungeons <laughs> and we will we will I think we're gonna do that after episode here it's gonna be another lady right there trying to push us off go get that. There's going to be a big ambush here. Not messing with that anymore. Get this. Cold blood do. Fatty right there. Get him to come. Plus. Love the repeating pistol. Don't go down there yet. Gotta take care of all this. Twin bloodstone. Very nice. We'll go through this house right here. There is going to be a. Why you, you scum? Executioner, if you go in here, she'll slit your throat. Almost be dead. I don't know. She could one shot you. So if we die, got a nice run back. Cold blood. Got a bro here. Got me. I was trying to make blood bullets and uh, made them and then he hit me. Okay. <sighs> Ooh. 
really frustrating when you run out of bullets. I mean, I love using the repeating pistol, but you can see how you can run out of bullets really quickly. Um, this really sucks, because now I'm going to have to do a run back. <laughs> Very frustrating. Very frustrating. hard getting blood we're gonna get a rune here which is incredibly important don't fall lake rune really great rune transcription of the great ones in human voices ripples like watery reflection this rune means lake and whose me memorize it enjoy reduced physical damage great volumes of water serve bulwark guarding sleep and augur of eldritch truth overcome the hindrance and seek what is yours Here we can actually make, beat the boss. Coming up on the boss right here.
this. Open this. Tempering gemstone. And I hope we can beat the boss. <laughs> we have 14 blood vials. Should be enough, but it's a little bit of a puzzle type boss fight, this next boss fight. There's gonna be two witches. And we're gonna have to kinda and man, no one's there. Almost forgot him. Well, as well. <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah, there's gonna be two of them. We're gonna have to. You can't see one of uh, the other one at first, but we're gonna have to damage them equally. These guys. Second one will show up soon. Want to get a visceral. the other one because that has no damage. Nice. So both of the hurt points should follow. Shot eye. We light this. Go in here. Door. This is so cool. We see someone tied to a chair, a hunter. And we pick up the work the rune workshop tool. Runesmith Carol student. A Bergenworth transcribed the inhuman utterings of the Great Ones into what we now called Carol Runes. The hunter who retrieves his workshop tool can etch Carol Runes into mind and attain wondrous strength. Provost Willem 
would be have been proud of the Carol runes as we do not rely uh, rely upon blood. Sure. Our first mention of Provost Willem. Now we're done with Hemwick. All in one episode. I'm super happy about that. Let's level up and get some runes on. We can continue on in the next one. I'm thinking of doing the next Chalice Dungeon. Oh, which I hate. I really don't like the Chalice Dungeons. Very but... Let me stay. Farewell, good up me. Let's upgrade our, uh... Cleaver. Also, I'm gonna get more, especially when we do the ch uh, chalice dungeon. But let's get on all three of these. I don't know why we'll use Beast, but that's why we need to. We got it anyway. We got it anyway. Guys, thanks so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everyone.